What's good, Meat Boys? If you're new here, he's me. I'm Boy. We're Meat Boy MMA. This is the Meat Event. And uh, we appreciate you grilling and chilling with us. So uh, smash that subscribe button if you're looking for locks and laps. But it's the Meat Event. Steven Wonderboy Thompson going up, going up against Jeff Hands of Steel Neal. And this is a super interesting fight. One of those how good are you really fights. Because if you can get a win over Steven Thompson, that is a huge for your career and a major feather in your cap. So we'll see if Jeff Neal has what it takes, but he's looked super talented in his undefeated UFC run so far. He has nice wins over Bilal Muhammad, Mike Perry, and uh, the hybrid Nico Price. But in this MMA puzzle, Stephen Thompson is definitely a strangely shaped piece. So Stephen Thompson, we saw recently get a nice win over Vicente Luque at MSG. We were there. Um, and this will be both guys' first fights in 2020 because Hands of Steel's most recent fight was in December of last year as well. So who you got in this main event? Uh, yeah, love this fight, but I, you know, I gotta go with my Wonder Boy. Uh, you you know, that is my dude. Uh, I think he's gonna get it done pretty convincingly. I think this is a levels test, but mm -hmm. man, hands of steel, Jeff Neal. Uh, he throws bombs, and uh, we did see, uh, you know, Thompson get Superman punched by Wheatbox, who is fighting on the undercard on this card, uh, and that is a little concerning. But I think, you know, he's learned from that. I don't think he's going to make that same mistake. Uh, he was dominating that whole fight. Then he, you know, slipped up, got caught. So we do know that Wonderboy can get knocked out if he gets connected. And if anyone can do it, it's going to be hands of steel. This is, I mean, such a pick for me. But yeah, I have to go with Wonderboy. I think he's just too good on the feet. His footsies and spacing, uh, I mean, he, he just he does such a good job at controlling, you know, uh, the octagon uh, and I don't see this going to the ground at all so I don't think there's gonna be a mauling by Jeff Neal on the ground uh, this is gonna be a pure stand-up battle on who's better on the feet and I gotta go with Wonder Boy Thompson yeah I'm with you I think that karate is gonna be huge he's definitely gonna have the uh, stand-up advantage and it's just gonna be a frustrating evening for Jeff Neal who's gonna be trying to close the distance but unable to find Wonder Boy who just is seemingly impossible to hit sometimes when you're in there um, yeah, you mentioned Wheaties Box connecting on that YOLO Superman punch. That still blows my mind. When I think about that fight, I just am so baffled at how, at how that went down, uh, especially looking at Hands of Steel and, you know, how chiseled this dude's looking. So uh, I'm a little worried. You're right. You mentioned his nickname, Hands of Steel. If he does manage to close the distance and uh, connect with one of those meat bombs, then it could be lights out for Wonder Boy. But uh, I'm with you on this one. I like how you described it as a levels test. I, too, am going to go with Stephen Wonderboy Thompson. And of the 65% on Tapology, the majority of it is beige. They're going with that decision. So a little sliver of it is KOTKO. Is there any chance that uh, Stephen Thompson rediscovers that knockout power of his and uh, maybe sneaks a finish in this one? Or because it's five rounds, do you just lean to a uh, five-round destruction by Wonderboy? Yeah, I mean, I mean... I could totally see a five round destruction, you know, getting those points, doing lots of damage, kind of just absolutely destroying them on the feet. But also, man, Steven Wonderboy has no joke head kicks. I mean, I could see him throwing one of those amazing yeah. head kick knockouts and catching, uh, you know, hands of steel by surprise. Uh, and also, I mean, we've never seen a Jeff Neal go five rounds. So if it does go the decision, I'm really going to favor Thompson for that reason. Uh, if Jeff doesn't get it done in the first, you know, one to three rounds, it's going to be a very scary, interesting night, I would say. But who, who knows, he could, uh, you know, shock the world uh, and show us that he is that top 10 caliber. And maybe we might even see Wonderboy out the door if that's the case. But, you know, I'm still keeping uh, pretty bullish on Wonderboy. I think he's going to keep his job, get the job done and, you know, throw it down for a juicy little meat steak. I'm with you on this one. I think it's a meat boy meal and hands of steel is meeting Stephen Thompson's highlight reel because we're both going with uh, Wonderboy Thompson in this meat event. Thanks for going and showing with the boys.